Hello everyone. In today's class, we are going to see how to remove a background using select subject. To remove background, precisely, I have used lots of tools. I will share the links in the description. Watch that too. So let's start. Method one: Select subject. Go to file, place embedded, and select the image you need. Now go to select, select subject. Your subject will be selected. Now press Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Now press Ctrl T. If you see the reference image, the dog image is being horizontal. So right click and give flip horizontal. Now just press Enter. Let's import the cat image. Do the same process. Go to File, Place Embedded, Select, Select Subject. After the subject got selected, give Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Now give Ctrl T to adjust the image. Use Shift and Alt and scale the image. And remove the background using select subject. Method two: Quick actions. Open Photoshop. Select the image you need. Unlock the layer first. Go to Windows menu section and select Properties. A history panel opens up. There we have an option called Quick actions. Now you can see an option called Remove background. Just click. That's it. Our background got removed. You can see there. To check whether we have removed the background or not, go to layer mask option and press shift in the keyboard to check what we have removed. Now, to apply a color, go to adjustment layer and select solid color to apply color for the background. You Method 3 Magic Eraser Tool. Go to file open the image which you need let me select this image the image which i selected has only a solid color background you can see there the image which has only a white color background now let me select the tool called magic eraser tool using the magic eraser tool we can remove the solid color background from the image now just click on the background which you have to remove you can see that the background got removed. Now go to the adjustment layer and select the solid color option. You can choose any color you need. Now select the layer and drag and drop below the image layer. Now select the image layer and press Ctrl plus T for transform option. You can place the image anywhere in the document. Now we remove a solid color background from an image using magic eraser tool method 4 magic wand tool now we are going to use tool called magic wand tool before that unlock the layer and take the magic wand tool and just click in the solid color you can see there the whole background got selected right click on the selection and give feather option if you see there it's over 15 if we give this much amount of feather the selection will become too smooth you can see there so let's give the amount as 2. That's fine. We will get crisp and clean smooth edges. Just press delete and the background got deleted. To get rid of the selection, use Ctrl plus D. So let's create a new layer, drag and drop it below the image layer. And we are going to use a tool called paint bucket tool. Using that, we can fill the color in an empty layer. So use paint bucket tool and select the new layer and click. We will get the color. If you want to shift between foreground and background color, use X. If you double click the foreground palette, we will get color palette option. We can change the color which we need. And we can also use shortcuts to fill the color. Method 5 Magic Wand Tool using Layer Mask Technique. Let's go to Magic Wand Tool. The use of Magic Wand Tool is all about to select a solid color. Here the solid color is white. White. Let's select it. And now here, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to invert the selection. So use Control Shift I to inverse the selection and give layer masking over there. Now in the layers panel, you can check you got an option there. Now select that. That is the layer mask. 
to remove the area over there go to brush tool soft brush erase it you should select the layer mask there black will erase and if you change to white white will reveal so get back to black and erase it the layer mask option should be selected in the layers panel now select the layer scale it using ctrl t transform option place it there scale it using shift plus alt that's it now let method 6 quick selection tool just give ok if you are missing the layers panel in the interface press f7 in the keyboard or else you can go to window and check now let's import the file go to file place select the image and place now press ctrl t to scale the image use shift and alt to scale uniform scaling now let me place the image use shift and alt to scale uniform scaling now let's place the another image go to file place select the image and place let me hide it in the layers panel you can see there now select the first image rename it now select quick selection tool the shortcut is w now let's select this one just click and drag now use alt and click select the unwanted area that's it now press ctrl c okay let me give feather right click in the selection and give 12 just give ok now press ctrl c and ctrl v it will be copied in a new layer now let's open select the image and place now i am going to remove the title there so go to quick selection tool and select the area which you want let me select this area now press after the selection after the selection is done now press ctrl c and ctrl v your selection is being pasted in a new layer now drag and drop and place inside the group now press ctrl t and scale it using shift plus alt let me place it like this. Finally, we have seen six methods in a single video how to remove a background in Adobe Photoshop. I hope the video was useful. Thank you.